Good morning. Today is Thursday, August 16th, National Tell-A-Joke Day. How many tickles does it take to make a squid laugh? Tentacles. I'm Brian Sand, a regional editor with some stories you'll find in today's newspaper. Information continues to flow in from the Florida State Attorney's Office regarding Lois Reese, the Blooming Prairie woman who allegedly shot and killed her husband, and a woman she befriended in Fort Myers Beach, Florida. The third installment of inf information included more than 1,600 pages of photos, reports, and documents. Reporter Katie Lauer shares some of the more interesting items. And voters across southeastern Minnesota streamed to the polls in near record numbers on Tuesday. Election officials reported turnout numbers that were, in some cases, three to four times larger than those of the 2016 primary and, and twice those of 2014. The disparity is all the more surprising since 2014 was a presidential year and this is a midterm election. And finally, Mayo Clinic Health System offers monthly classes on how to properly install a car seat. Uh, the technicians who offer the classes are a combination of Mayo employees and staff from other organizations certified in, inst in the installation. And they look at an array of things to determine whether seats are being used properly. The difference can mean life or death. You can find all of that and the answer man in today's Post Bulletin.